Hero Brian's not real. At least that's what everybody says. No, 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 no. But some people swear that they've seen him. <laughs> Have we all been gaslit into believing something false? Or are we just not aware of the phantoms hiding in Minecraft's code? Mojang has literally been putting removed Hero Brian after every update until 1.16. Has this been a joke this whole time and they finally stopped caring about keeping the joke alive? Or is it a ruse for a deeper and darker secret that Minecraft has been hiding for years right under our noses, lurking in the shadows of the game? Either way, Hero Brian has become a myth, a legend of the game that has turned the world of Minecraft upside down. As for me, I don't know if he's real or not. I've never seen him. I've never seen a Siberian tiger or a King Cobra or Santa Claus. But I know that they're real, so why can't Herobrine be? We need to get to the bottom of this. I want to know the truth. Now, Herobrine wouldn't just spawn in any old Minecraft world that you create, right? Actually, I think he would if he's really a part of the game. But the data that I collected showed me that the further out from spawn you are, the more likely you the Herobrine encounter. So if I just teleport to the world border, then he is almost sure to spawn, right? In theory. Okay, Herobrine? Come and get me. Hey, yo! This is actually sick! Dude, I've never- I've never seen this before. What? This is crazy. Wow. I explored for a while with no sign of Herobrine, but my first experience of the Farlands was pretty sweet. Bro, I love this. Why haven't I done this sooner? So if we can't get him in a random world, I wasn't really expecting him anyway, uh, we'll just use a specific seed. One that is known for its strange occurrences. Okay, what's so special about this seed? Well, if you take the numbers and put them in the order of the alphabet, then it spells out here, Brian. Whoa, this is insane. In all of my years of Minecraft, I have never seen world generation like this. <laughs> what the heck? It looks like it's in an amplified world, but it's literally just a normal world. I believe it's in this place where we'll find the answers behind the mystery of Herobrine. Hey, Mr. Sheep, do you know where I can find Herobrine? No? Okay, okay. <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> Wait, what? Where, where did he go? Hmm, whatever. Yo, what? Are you seeing this? There are a ton of sheep. That's crazy. What? Dude, 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 dude. That's not, that's not funny. Am I going crazy? Were there not just like 30 sheep there a second ago? I'm so confused. Hey, I see a village. Let's go. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. No mobs anywhere. There's not a single villager in this village. I spent the next hour exploring and found absolutely nothing. I thought for sure this was gonna work. I'm beginning to think that Herobrine really is just a tall tale, but wait. I've been going about this all wrong. I've sort of been waiting around for Herobrine to show up. We aren't going to find him that way. I need to be more proactive in my search. So I began building monuments that could lure Herobrine to my location. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm doing and I don't think this is gonna work, but it's not like I've ever hunted Herobrine down before. I built a Herobrine statue, a brick pyramid to the side, two by two tunnels, and stripped the leaves off the trees. Okay, Herobrine, show yourself. Nothing? Ugh, I think I'm done. What even is this video? Ugh. <gasps> what was that? What was that? Dude, what the heck? Okay, okay, maybe I was a bit too hasty. <laughs> maybe my imagination's just playing tricks on me, but are you guys hearing that? Oh my gosh, I am a little sleep deprived. What was I thinking? Of course it's not gonna work building monuments. I'm sure a bunch of people have done that in the past, but I had one final trick up my sleeve. A surefire way to truly know. All right, I'm in the nether with the right materials. If this works, I don't know what I'll do. Oh, I'm nervous. <laughs> What if it's actually there? What if Herobrine's actually re You know what? Whew. Here we go. Time to summon Herobrine. Oh, I'm kind of glad nothing happened. Whew. Well, at least we know that Herobrine's actually- What happened? Um, guys, what is happening, bro? Okay, I'm- I'm done with this. I am done here. Time to go, time to go. come on, come on, come on. I, I think it may have worked. Okay, dude, what just happened? Did we actually just summon Hero Brian? No way did that work. Uh, I shouldn't have left. I should have waited to see what happened. I'm going back. 
Okay, what? Everything's back to normal. I'm not going crazy, am I? Maybe I need to see a psychiatrist after this experience. I explored and waited for something strange to happen, but that's when I realized how fun this was. It was like I was discovering a new part of the game all on my own. It was kind of exciting, that, that feeling of enjoying something for the first time. So although I didn't find any real evidence, I loaded up a new world and started playing hardcore mode. It's been a long time since I've enjoyed the game this way. Man, it was bringing back all the nostalgia I once had. Building a house, then exploring the world, discovering lands never seen or touched by another player. But while I was on this nostalgia high, something mysterious happened. Alright, more diamonds. I can make some armor with that, and whoa, whoa, look at the fog. I've never seen this before. My shader's doing something wacky. Dude, I can barely see. What the, what the? Um, get back to my chest really quick. <gasps> Check behind me. Yo, this is not cool. What is go- Ah! Whoa, what was that? here oh my goodness my house is on fire my stuff oh no 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 bro this doesn't just happen the weather doesn't just change like that this is just whoa hey whoa. dude this isn't right there are like 40 zombies here they just spawned out of thin air whoa, whoa I'm gonna die they are chasing me out of my home No! I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm gonna die. Oh my goodness. How am I supposed to survive? Okay, dig down. Just dig down. What the heck? This is not just a coincidence. That doesn't just happen. Something's affecting my game. It's gotta be Hero Brian. There's no other explanation. Okay, I'm just glad that I'm safe here for a bit. I can think and get my. What's that noise? Hello? Are they breaking the blocks? How is that possible? I don't have a mod that even does that. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna die. No, 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 no. Oh. I can't believe this is happening. Oh my gosh. Oh wait, I can make a portal. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Okay, go through, go through! Oh my goodness! That was too close for comfort. I never thought I'd feel safer in the nether. Uh, I'm not. It's Hero <laughs> Brian. That's right, it's me. I've enjoyed watching you unravel this mystery. Building a statue of me. <laughs> So creative. So you were there. Yes, I've been watching and observing you. You are a much more interesting person than I've dealt with before. After all, you are a storyteller. How do you know that? My, you insult my intelligence. You don't think I know what goes on outside of this wretched game? You wouldn't even know about me if I didn't let them discover me. What? That's right. You think people have been gaslit into believing I'm real? But what you don't realize is that I have been the one pulling the strings this whole time. What? Some I've led on believing they've seen me. What? Others I erase entirely. Erase? <laughs> you mean brainwash. Now you're getting it. I like you. You present unique attributes that will be useful in my plans. Plans? I'm not joining you if that's what you want. Oh. That was not a request, dear Shadow. You have no idea how little power you have in this situation. <laughs> Welcome, for you no. are now under my control. Let me go! My no! Sleep tight no! until the dawn is awakening. My quest for finding Herobrine ended in vain. It turns out that he may really be just a myth. Some part of me really just wanted to discover him and finally know the truth. He adds a mystery to this game and makes it feel alive. I may not have found all the answers today, but what I've realized through this experience is that things are never as they seem. That things will become clearer in the end. When the final bell sounds, you know it will be time. Time for your eyes to be all over time. And who knows, he may still be lurking in the shadows, watching and waiting for the perfect time to strike.